here from fitnessequipmentcafe.com and I'm at the Australian Fitness and Health Expo in sunny Melbourne for the very first time. And welcome uh, Darren, the, the New South Wales uh, Sales Manager yeah, for Matrix. Yeah, that's right, thanks. Nice to be here. Um, so basically tell me a little bit about Matrix and uh, what you've got on offer this year in 2014. Alright, Matrix is a global company. Yep. Uh, we're the uh, local SBU for that company, so we're a true manufacturer. Um, 20 SBUs around the world so a truly global company and um, what we've got on offer here today is a range of cardio and strength but in particular we're showing a high focus on our um, my ride plus program which you can see in the background yeah absolutely. Uh, it's phenomenal it, uh, I, I actually um, as a gym manager um, bought the original my rides that were on the on those stands yeah and, sure um, you know so and they were great yeah they, they are we still have the personal units yep. for the cardio floor but um they've taken it to the next level with the uh, My Ride Plus, which is for group um, instruction and interaction. Yep. Not only on a live coaching perspective, but also um, in two formats on a virtual perspective. So it really um, allows club owners to get a better return on investment yep. in their downtime. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, and that's really important to be able to maximise that uh, the usage of it, just not not just in a class environment. Yeah, most definitely, because most of the classes, you know, if a club runs 15 to 20 classes a week in their spin room. Um, it's probably equates to about 15% of their opening hours. Yep. That room sits yep. dormant the rest of the time, and absolutely, if they haven't got the right style of bikes with any feedback or engagement. Yep. Then essentially the room sits empty for long periods. Absolutely, and you can really develop a nice cycling culture, can't you? Again, yeah, it. definitely. And what what we promote the product to do is also lead a lot of the new um, exercises that join the gym into a cycle class by starting in the virtual. Yep. Um, so they use the program effectively. It essentially um, will will get more people in their live classes yes. because yep. we know um, new members, steady state exercise, 20 minutes on a stationary bike, a live class of any format for 40 minutes can be too tough. A negative experience, they don't come back to become a cyclist. So, so yeah, it's a great way of easing in, and, and we found that actually in our gym too that people did that use the my ride were actually you know, more likely to actually join a class so yeah. in the in the long term. So Definitely, and we've got some big chains that have taken it on board. Yep, they're early adopters of the program, and the feedback we're getting from them at the moment is it's really helping to increase their cycling numbers in in the club. Fantastic. Now, is there anything particular about the bikes, or they're just standard bikes, and you can just put them in front of the machine? Um, oh, the, sorry, the uh, screen. Yeah, <laughs> probably not not so much standard. They're, they're, the IC3 is our new bike, and technology in the computer. Um, it's got a, a smaller Q factor of 155 mil, right. which will give you a, a more natural and outdoor riding experience. Right, which is really what you want. Which is important, yep. yeah. They're a belt driven product, heavier flywheel, um, and a few unique changes that we've made. Mm. It's the new bikes coming out. Well, uh, my battery died, and uh, so we're back, and we're talking about the, the uh, My Ride system. Yep, and the Coach by Color concept we were just chatting about, which is a, uh, a new bike. It's been much of a game changer in the industry with uh, wattage feedback um, and not only the wattage feedback but the way it's taught, the way the uh, the watts is read from the um, bottom bracket. Right. Uh, there's some uh, unique technology in that, yeah. uh, very accurate and um, can't wait to get it to Australia actually. Yeah, when does that arrive? Uh, potentially Q4 this year. Q4, uh, wow. so, so look out for that one. Yeah, latter year. Um, there's a lot of interest that was launched at Ursa just recently. Right, right. Okay, brilliant. Um, and in terms of uh, the rest of your range, you, you've got a, a, a big contingency of um, uh, your, your cardio. Um, so can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, cardio and strength. We've got about 420 products now. Um, wow. And that has evolved that way through our acquisition of Magnum right. in the States. So we now have a complete um, range of not only our selectorized equipment, yep. um, but we've also got a good plate loaded range right. and uh, many product SKUs in our cardio from your treadmills to your new climb mills, ascent trainers and three styles of bikes. We've got our uprights, our recumbents and we're hybrids. Fantastic. Um, so yeah, we've got a really good package and a good portfolio Yep. and uh, we can cater for everyone's needs. And yes, and you, you do obviously still um, sell the traditional uh, LED screens as well as the um, the new touch screens? Definitely, yeah. We're, we have everything from a one series cardio 
radio unit up to the new 7XI console. Which and they're is, a beautiful console. Yeah, touch screen, 19 inch, and your Wi-Fi, your Twitter, yep. your Facebook, and yep. your MyFitnessPal. So it's where the consumer's going. Yeah. It's where the industry needs to go. And yeah, our product is um, it's very successful at the moment. And the customers are ready for it. I mean, we're, we've been used to tablets and, and smartphones for a while now, and it's just natural for the gym environment to go that way. However, this year, like no other, really has demonstrated a kind of a division between the two um, styles of training, isn't it? The minimalistic versions of what we're seeing through CrossFit and the likes of that. And then at this end of the market, it's very much about technology. Um, yeah, you're 100% right. Yeah, everyone's like tech savvy. Yep. And then you've got what seems to feel like a little bit of old school. Yeah. The grunt and groan and, and the basic equipment and, and get it done. So I think, um, like anything, with a new market, you'll have an extreme move to one end or the other. Yep. Um, and then over time, it will come back to the centre. And you'll probably find a hybrid model of cardio, strength, catering for this, catering for that, yep. all in the one club format. All in one club format. Yeah. Fantastic. All right, well, thank you very much, Darren. And it's been a pleasure. And uh, thank you. You know, long three days, but we're, we're nearly at the end of it. Yeah. So uh, you've enjoyed it? I have, and the body's only just holding up. Yeah. <laughs> that's great. Well, that's it for me. Thanks very much for watching. If you've got any comments about this interview or any others, I'd love to hear from you on the comments section. Just drop me a line.